Hey guys, welcome to another lunch show review. Today I'm going to McDonald's. They have a new, well, it's not really a meal, but anyway, I'll talk about it when I get back. But I ordered it online. I'm actually going to go in and pick it up because I want to ask them a question. So I'm going to run in, pick it up, and I'll be back and let you know what I got. Okay, so what I ordered was the new, the Kerwin Frost box. And I'll show you the box once I get the camera turned around. But it basically comes with, you can either get chicken nuggets or a Big Mac. I got the chicken nuggets, but the new Mambo sauce, which I've never tried the Mambo sauce. We'll see what it's like. Um, I got a sweet and sour just in case I don't like it. But anyway, we're going to try the new sauce that, it came out a while back, but I've just never tried it. You get a medium, I got a medium meal, so you can get a large fry if you want to, but I got a medium. And then you get a, a Nugget Buddy, and they're in these boxes. So you have no clue what's inside of them until you actually break the seal and open it up. Uh, there are six characters inside. You can see there's what they look like. Let's see if it has a, yeah. They got, I'll show you on the box uh, a better idea of what they, what they look like. What if one day you woke up as a nugget, McNugget? That would be kind of scary because someone would probably eat you. Um, so anyway, I'm going to show you the box and then I'll, um, then we'll try out everything and then I'll open the toy and see what we get. All right. So I ordered on the app, um, which was the, the easiest way to order. Um, so my total, the, the Kerwin box, the Kerwin Frost box, it was $11.59. I got it written down. Um, $11.59 you get, um, you know, tax and stuff like that. It ended up being $12.29 for total. Um, and that's with the chicken nuggets, the medium fries. Um, I actually got two sauces, but they didn't charge me extra for them. And then um, um, the drink. So I got a medium um, diet, Coke Zero. Um, so it's the meal is 730 calories, and then each sauce is 60 calories each. So just to let you know. So I'm gonna try the food out first, and then I'll, I'll give you the tour of the box. McDonald's fries, pretty standard. These actually have a really good amount of salt on them, which is good because sometimes they don't. Let me dump them out in this box. Um, yeah, so those are pretty good. I, I like their fries. Their fries are one of those things where, at least for me, um, if they're good and hot, they taste really good and they, they uh, are pleasurable to eat if they're good and hot. But boy, once they get cold, um, they are not very good at all. And the good thing, these are good and hot. So that's good. Uh, McDonald's fries is not something I would ever go like out of my way to get, but they're good to get occasionally. Um, I know some people swear by McDonald's fries. For me, it's more of a, you know, yeah, it's a, it, they're good. They're not bad, they're, um, but they're not something I'm gonna go just get fries, you know, just for that. So this mambo sauce, I don't know what the mambo sauce is. It's a 10 ounce, or oh, sorry, um, a one ounce package of sauce. And it's got like a little red star on it. Okay, it's kind of orange colored. It smells kind of like a, like a teriyaki sauce. If you can, kind of a orangey kind of color. And this comes with a 10 piece nugget too. Yeah, it's kind of like, it's almost like the sweet and sour, except it's more, um, it's more opaque and it's a little more orange. Um, huh. hmm. Got a little kick to it. It's sweet, um, but it's got some spice to it. Wow. It's got some peppers in it. Um, gives you a little burn in the back of your throat. These nuggets are not super hot, just to let you know. Um, they're good and crispy, they're just not very hot. I like this sauce. Um, if you like, kind of like a sweet and sour sauce, but with more of a, like a pepper, like a hot pepper kind of flavor, with a, with some heat in the back of your throat. I mean, like really good and hot. I think you'll like that. So the comparison, the sweet and sour sauce is my favorite. Yeah, there's a sweet and sour. It's kind of a, kind of a brown color. Can't beat the classic sweet and sour sauce. I used to get, um, I've actually always gotten sweet and sour, but I have tried their barbecue. 
and stuff like that. It's good. It's a good sauce, but I still always go back to the sweet and sour. I tell you what, though. After eating the mambo sauce, um, the sweet and sour sauce is kind of plain. Definitely has a chili pepper flavor. It's weird having the the hot pepper flavor, but then you also get a sweetness there. I like those. I usually take my fries and dip it in my sweet and sour sauce. I wonder what the fries taste like with this mambo sauce. Not bad. You still get a lot of that um, that pepper flavor. And I'm not saying pepper is in salt and pepper. I'm saying like peppers. Like, like jalapeno or something. Although I think that's more I think that's more chili pepper. Not chili powder. But a chili peppers hot peppers um than a jalapeno because i don't uh, jalapenos have a very distinct like green kind of flavor that doesn't taste like that this is more of a like a just a spicy pepper it's pretty spicy though so just keep that in mind so the meal you know the nuggets could be a little hotter the fries the fries were always good um so for just the meal itself I would probably give it, I don't know, if the nuggets were hotter and stuff, I'd probably get higher, but it's a it's a four out of five. It's not bad, but um, you know, you're really not here to see the the meal, honestly. You're here to see the box. Let me go go one more nugget. I do like that spicy mambo sauce. That mambo sauce, if you're liking a peppers flavor with uh with some heat, I think you'll like it. That makes my boring my sweet and sour sauce seem kind of boring. All right. Let me put that to the side. All right, so the box, um, this is the Kerwin Frost box. There's the top. Can I see around it? There's the one side of the top. There's the other side of the top. Bottom, bottom's pretty straightforward. Red box, no big deal. And then you've got the sides. So there's one side. There's the other side. That side. And that's up. So they're really wanting to mix and match. Um, yo, buddy, check it out. We all swapped outfits. Can you tell who's who? So it's a little game. Okay. Um, this is saying their name. So we've got Don, Don Bernice, or Dot, sorry, Dot Bernice. I think it's Dot, D O T T. Their font's a little weird. Dot Bernice, um, Darla. Then you've got Brick, Brick. So Darla is the one with the yellow thing in her hair. Um, Dot is the older looking woman. The one that looks icy is Brick, Brick. Um, Wafutu? Waf I can't tell what that name is. It's some, some of the little uh, chicken nugget on its belly. Uh, Kerwin Frost is the one with the top hat. And that's the one I hope I get. And Uptown Mo. I cannot read the name of this one. W... W W L A F F U T U Walfutu. I can't I can't tell. That one right there. I can't tell what the name is. Welcome to Frost Way. Uh, then they've just got like pictures of them on the on the end over here. Now I don't, I don't know what that one's name is. It doesn't. It's it's really hard to read. So maybe it says it on here better. No, it is Don Bernice. Don Bernice. Um, I thought it was an old woman. Maybe it's a man. Um, Uptown Mo, Darla Wafutu. W-A-F-F-U-T-U. Wafutu. Uh, Kerwin Frost and Brick. Um, and by the way, I tried to... I, I, I didn't try. I did ask. Um, if you can buy these on their own, you cannot. You cannot buy these separately. You have to buy them with a meal. 
she said um she said matter of fact it says right here on our instruction sheet that you cannot buy them separately so uh, if you want to try to collect all these they're in boxes so they can't even look for you to see what you're going to get it does not say on the box anywhere yeah what this one is so it's literally just a random you're randomly going to get what you get so you might have to buy you know 25 meals to get all six of these so just know that okay so you open it up you get um is it a card <coughs> um mcnugget legend so that's your card and it says uh it dips in honey mustard uh golden like arches golden like the, like the fries golden like the edges on mcdonald's apple pie close your eyes and make a wish um can you collect all of them mcnugget buddies and this is just uh, i got the mcnugget legend the the gold one and then you got the character it's it's actually wrapped up in like uh, tissue paper and that's it in the box it's just the the rest of the box is empty so let's switch to see what character i got it's like wrapped up in a hamburger package but it, it says Kerwin frost all over it Oh, I literally got the golden nugget. I didn't know that was even a character. Well, why would I want a golden? Is it special? Is it special because it's golden? I wanted an actual character. I didn't want a golden one. That's not even one they all, they even mention. Hmm. I'll have to look up and see if this is a rare one or if this is the consolation prize for getting um, sucky characters. I don't know. So anyway, um, yeah, this is the golden the the mcnugget legend i guess that's what i got i would have rather had uh, the curran with the hat i like that one better but anyway this paper actually says uh um Kerwin frost on it i think that's kind of cool so anyway i hope you enjoy this video it really wasn't more it wasn't as much about the food as it was the box and the character which i don't know i i think i think i got, I got screwed on the character because i wanted one of the cool characters but whatever that like i said that maybe this is an ultra rare one or maybe it's so common that, um, you know, people just give it away for free. Who knows? I don't know. So anyway, I uh, hope you enjoy this video. Uh, thanks for watching.